guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel today's video is what i eat in a day on the slimming world plan also a clothing haul also my weigh-in results so let's get straight into the video So this is what I'm having for breakfast this morning. I am so excited for this. So this is, was inspired by someone on Instagram, so I'll put their name on the screen, but they used bread and they did it in the frying pan. I did it in the air fryer because I thought if I flip it over, all this goodness is gonna fall off. So yeah, it worked out well in the air fryer. So I've got my cheese, is half my healthy extra A. I've got peppers, onions, a speed food and i've got ham on there which i didn't film which is protein and then three sins each for the crumpets um so that is six sins and half my healthy extra a for this morning's breakfast and just got myself a coffee here so i'm gonna go and enjoy this now good morning guys so i've had breakfast and when i tell you that breakfast was a 10 out of 10 it was a 10 out of 10 absolutely delicious it was yeah indulgent lovely so I'm actually making lunch now and I'm making like my lunch tea. So basically Dan's out tonight um, and so it's just going to be obviously me and the kids and so it's going to be a bit of a stressful night trying to get them all sorted ready for bed and then both asleep. So I'm actually going to have like a bigger lunch now and then I'm just going to have something small later on. Um, so I'm just going to make that now. I've got some mints which need to use up. So I'm actually going to um, do something with that. Um, I finished chopping those peppers and onions earlier. So I'm going to use that in it. Um, I've got shopping coming today as well. So a lot's going on. So I'm just trying to be as prepared as possible. Had a pizza last night and there's still some pizza in the fridge. And when I tell you the temptation of just getting that pizza out and warming it up. Um, yeah, the temptation was real, but I didn't. I'm very determined to stop on plan for the rest of the week. I had an off day yesterday. It was the day after weigh-in. It was a stressful day. Dan even brought me a bottle of wine on the way back from work because he could hear the kids just screaming and going crazy. So yeah, it was like, I stopped on plan all day and then it got to the evening and that was like, I'm not cooking. I was so hot as well. That's why doing something like this now is better than doing it later because it's not too bad in the house at the minute. Whereas later, like the sun comes in our kitchen in the later afternoon and it gets really, really hot in here. So yeah, that's the update. So breakfast, we use six sins and 20 grams of cheese. So I think I'm gonna use like 10 grams of cheese on my lunch just to use that healthy extra A up. Um, yeah, really feeling really, really positive. Um, I definitely feel in the right mindset, like I, I can do this, or I can do this. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna show you what I'm having for dinner now. And then I will check in with you when I have something else to eat later. So this is what I'm having for my lunch main meal today. So pasta, which is a free food. And then I've just used whatever I had left over. So I've got onions, peppers, which are a free food, free and speed food. Um, I had half a tin tomatoes left over in the fridge. So I've put that in there. Some mince, which is 5%. So that's protein. And then 10 grams of cheese as my healthy extra A, the other part of healthy extra A. Um, so no sins for lunch today. Hey guys, um, so this part of the video, we are going to be trying some sportswear on. So we're gonna be reviewing it, doing a try on haul, let you know my thoughts. So these products are from Yvette Sports, which I absolutely I love the look of their website we will try the clothes on shortly but they are so inclusive they go from size range to this to this and they have a variety of different sportswear on there shorts leggings jumpers lots of good stuff um yeah so i really like the look of it so let's have a look at their products and um, 
and give them a try. So, first of all, and I'm going to be completely 100% with you, I have actually worn this outfit already. I'm going to try it on as well, but I already know I love it. I'm going to tell you that now. Now, I ordered this in the mind of this weather at the minute. It is roasting, so I wanted something to be able to do my walking in and not feel really, really hot and sweaty and still be really, really comfortable. Um, so, I went for this top here. So, as you can see, it's a strappy top. You see the back here. I am going to be trying it on as well shortly. And I love the detail of this top. And it has got um, a bit of padding in here as well. I have had two children. So without too much information, things aren't as perky as they used to be. So having this sort of support on here is a must for me. Because obviously this sort of top, you can't really wear a bra with it. It's going to be quite difficult to wear a bra with it. Um, so that is the first top. And it's got the little logo here which i love this these i absolutely love these are the most comfy shorts ever i am a comfort person so i like sportswear because i like to use them to like work out walk in and things like that but i also like them in everyday life i like to do the school run in them i like to wear them at home i like to wear them going to the shop i just like comfy clothes so it does have to be comfy and these little shorts here so what I love about these are they are the like show you like so I'm gonna try them on. So they've got like the shorts here and then they've got like the little skirt over the top. So they've got the comfort of the shorts and they've obviously got this little band here. Um so you've got the comfort of the shorts, but then you've got a little bit of a feminine touch um with the overskirt as well. So this is beautiful but i will try it on uh, and let you know oh this is the first little outfit here so we've got the shorts um which i love this little pull in here and then you've got the little skirt just over the top and then with the little strappy top nice support in this area and little crisscross at the back so the products which I haven't actually tried on yet. So I have these gorgeous looking leggings. So they've got the detail at the top here. Um, and yeah, they are a nice little, I think these are called like yoga trousers. Um, but yeah, I really like the look of them. Oh my God, I'm so in love with these trousers. I love the little, you can actually tighten them. I know sometimes you have these here, but they don't actually do anything. But you can actually tie so it just goes over your foot i don't know what the technical term for this is but the technical term i'm liking to use is it means my trousers aren't going to rise up yay they just hate that when they rise up um so this i thought i thought i'd get a few different things so we've got like the leggings we've got the shorts we've got the top and then now we've got a hoodie so obviously this you could wear for anything this can be like not at the minute you wouldn't want to wear it but this can be like as it gets a little bit so this is the jumper here so really nice oversize which i love it's got the logo here i love the color as well um so this is always oh, really it's got like a nice weight to it as well when you know that's when you know it's good quality and again the pull strings at the front so this is obviously going to be this you can wear whenever you can wear this to go for a nice walk you can wear when the weather gets a little bit colder you can wear it with your leggings and it's just going to look fabulous and i just love the color of this i really really do yeah i can't believe how weighty it is it's yeah it feels really good quality obsessed with this outfit this whole look i love i'm an autumn kind of girl i do love the autumn i'm not gonna lie and i am feeling lovely autumn work walks with this before it gets too cold or you don't need to wear a coat you've got your leggings you've got your boots on your trainers your walking boots whatever you want to wear you got the dogs and you are just nice and cozy in this i love it i love that it's oversized Obviously, if you didn't want it so oversized, you could definitely size down on it. It's got a pull string here. Oh, this is brilliant. It's got a pull string here. So if you kind of want it a little bit more ruched up, um, you could pull it here and have it a bit more like a cropped um, jumper where you've got that gorgeous 
logo there again. So it's like a million degrees out and I still have the hoodie on because it's so cozy and lovely. I just love it. So that is my little clothing haul and um, I am going to pop all the details um, down below if you want to order from them. I am... I'm going to be completely honest, I am blown away by the quality and the fit of all the products. Um, these products were kindly gifted. Um, it's not a paid ad or anything like that. It's still all my own opinion and I'll always can be completely honest um, when I am gifted products. But I am blown away with the quality. The delivery was fast, the customer service was great. That's a really key point for me as well. Um, I like to have a good customer service. Um, I am so, so happy with everything. The shorts and top I have wore a couple of times already, so I know I love them. The leggings fit beautifully and this jumper just feels such good quality. Um, I'm excited, I am getting a little bit hot now though. <laughs> I'm excited to get so much use out of this in the autumn um, because I know, oh even the summer, because we know that the summers here are, are not always warm are they? So thank you so much Yvette Sport for kindly gifting me these products. I am in love with them, I'm going to get so much use out of them and if you do want to check them out I'll pop all their details below. I would recommend them and I would recommend even if you just pop on the website, have a little browse, see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Um, yeah, so that's it from the try and haul and we'll get straight over to the next part of the video. Good afternoon everybody. I felt like I was a teacher then. Good afternoon everybody. Um, I've just had the food shop. It came a little bit early but I'm not mad because it's getting warmer and warmer. So I've managed to film that and put it away and I've had dinner. The kids have just been fed. So we're feeling good. I'm on my second lot of water so far today. Um, so I've already drank out one and a half litres. Um, and step count, we are on, let's have a look. We're on 9,983. So it's about half one and I'm nearly here my 10,000 steps. So yeah, we're feeling good. We're feeling positive today. The test is when Dan's out later, am I gonna sit downstairs and eat these biscuits? No, I'm not. Um, I've got a lot to do tonight, so apart from sorting the kids out, we're going to a barbecue tomorrow, so I want to fake tan, and we're out nearly all day tomorrow as well, um, just doing a few errands and things like that. Um, so yeah, we've got a busy night and a busy day tomorrow. So tomorrow is gonna be a real, real test to see if I stop on plan. Um, it's obviously barbecue food. I'm gonna just probably maybe have like a burger or maybe a sausage and then just have like a salad with it no cobs or anything like that um and maybe try and have something to eat before i go just to not be tempted i'm not going to drink any alcohol um i'm just going to have like some squash and um yes i have got my wine here i only had one glass last night um i'm gonna put that in the fridge and maybe save that for next weekend i'm not sure how long you meant to keep wine but i'm sure it's fine it's not like it's prosecco and it goes flat um so yeah i'm really really like in the zone to keep on it this week and get a loss next week so yeah harper's getting a bit restless in her chair now because she's just finished her lunch um so i will pop back on when i have something else to eat right, i'm gonna have one of these for four sins i popped this in the freezer early not for too long because i didn't want it frozen frozen but i just wanted it a bit cold and a bit thicker um so i'm gonna have one of these now for four sins So, just had a message from Dan saying he's going to be running late from work, which is great. Um, which means I'm actually going to do dinner early tonight because it's just it just means I, I was kind of planning Dan get home before he goes out, sorting everything out, and then he goes out and then I can put the kids to bed. But obviously that's not going to work now. So, um, I'm going to do dinner now for everybody. I'm going to show you what I've got. Um, it's something really quick and easy, so I am going to have some fruit when the kids are asleep, but I'll be able to film that and show you that later. But for now, this is what I'm having for my dinner tonight. So, I've got Sainsbury's bread, um, two of them as your healthy extra B. I've got beans, which are a free food, and one sin for a tablespoon. 
of tomato ketchup. So one sin and my healthy extra beef for dinner tonight. I'm just feeding Harper at the minute and Henry's playing in the garden. I can see him right there and you'll laugh if you could see him. He's literally emptied, literally, literally emptied the shoe box and he's got some of Dan's football boots in there. He's got a pair of heels over there and he's just walking around the garden with like every pair of shoes on. It's hilarious. Um, so, yeah, you think it's funny too, don't you? So, while I've got a minute, I thought, let's do the weigh-in update. Because I was thinking, oh, it's going to have to be tomorrow now. I'm not going to have time to do it tonight. But while I've got a minute, I thought, let's do it. So, we had, so what day are we on at the minute? We're on Friday. And we had weigh-in on Wednesday. And last week was just, I've mentioned it on a few videos. I think I had four, give me your spoon back. Give me your spin back. I think I had four days off plan and three days on plan. Um, so yeah, I didn't do well at all. And I think I said on one of my videos as well that I was kind of thinking it was gonna be about a two pound gain. Um, so that is exactly what it was. It was a two pound gain this week. I knew it. Was I annoyed? Yes. Was it my own fault? Absolutely. Um, did I learn from it? Well, I thought I did, but then yesterday was Thursday and I had a Domino's. I explained earlier in the video why I had a Domino's. What, baby? Oh, okay. So, but I am back on it. I've been back on it all day today. Today has been extremely stressful, um, but I haven't given in. I've tried to fit my food around everything today. Um, and I always say like you shouldn't have to fit your food around your life but sometimes you just kind of have to <laughs> um, yeah especially when you're trying to get back on it sometimes when you've been off plan it can be a bit of a struggle getting back on plan and it's not like as straightforward as just not thinking about food oh dear um, sometimes it's not as straightforward as just not thinking about food um, you do have to plan a lot and really sort of like scheduling when you're gonna have your food what you're gonna have especially when you've got a busy life or especially when you've got small kids that you've got to try and fit it around as well um, so yeah I've been on plan today um, breakfast was lovely um lunch was nice and obviously tea tonight was like really simple um but it was lovely i don't even know how many sins were on so this morning was a high sin breakfast so it was six sins this morning um harper's right next to me so if you can hear her coughing she's fine she's right next to me <laughs> yeah um yeah so six sins this morning lunch we didn't have any sins for that and then Tea. She's just her spoon. She's playing with the spoon and she just keeps shoving it in her mouth. So I won't get anything on it. She's already eating her tea now. Um, yes. Yeah, so anyway, I'm getting distracted. So nothing for dinner and then one sin for tea tonight for that ketchup. Is that everything? So six. I feel like I missed something. I can't think. Oh, I had that that moussey thing which was really really nice lovely and it did taste like ice cream um so i know you can get a lot of like low fat ice creams and things like that in the tubs but i find them really, really expensive they were the smart price ones and they were less than a pound um so if you are looking for like an ice cream or a mousse or whatever it's four sins and it was really really nice so yeah that actually leaves us on 11 sins i believe so yeah more than i would is it so six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen yeah eleven sins so more than I would like to be on because I'm not sure whether I can have a snack tonight or not. I am definitely going to be having fruit tonight because um, it is only just gone four o'clock and we, you know, I've already had my tea. So I know later and I've got quite a lot to do tonight as well. Um, so I am going to plan in to have some fruit tonight. I think maybe like strawberries um quark and maybe some yogurt as well that's usually my go-to snack so yeah i will show you that when i have that whether i'll have like any other sinned things i don't know um obviously all my chocolates are like five sins or more or i could have a high five i suppose um or a hot chocolate 
but I'll let you know if I have anything else. So yeah, a really good day on plan today. Really happy with how everything's gone. That's everything from me today, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, pop me a comment, and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And that's everything from me today. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.